Hi everybody, it's Katie Jo. There's a story that I read in one of Alberto Veloto's books about a shaman who had come across this village, and I believe this is a true story. He'd come across this village in their travels and their hiking who was suffering from no rain, and their crops were dying, and their people were thirsty, and this well-famed shaman came, and so all the people were saying, help us, help us, could you bring in the rains, because we know you're shaman. And so, for three days, the shaman went into meditation and prayer, and on the third day, it rained. And so, his apprentice said, wow, how did you do that? When all these people are praying, all these people are crying out for rain, how was it that you were able to do that? And the shaman replied, they were praying for rain, I was praying rain. Now the meaning behind that is simply this. Whenever we separate ourselves from Creator, from nature, from elements, we are always extending and placing that separate from us. We're saying that is outside of me and we're placing an invisible wall between us and them. But when we recognize that when we pray, we are in fact going deep within and recognizing that divine place inside of us. And when we pray for rain, instead we pray rain and recognize that I am rain, I am fire, I am air, I am earth, I am all things. But I tap into that frequency of the rain, the frequency of the water, the frequency of all that is, and I am all that is. In that place, every answer is available to us. In that place, every miracle is possible. In that place, we recognize who we truly are as a divine being connected to all other divine beings, elements, minerals, animals. So, if you are feeling inspired, to call forth rain and to call forth the balance amongst the four elements that we're witnessing right now across our planet which is the earthquakes and tsunamis and the hurricanes and the fires I invite you to pray balance pray harmony pray rain pray fire pray um, wind ceasing pray earth calm pray those things and mostly pray in the awareness that you are more than you could ever conceive to be. Aho.